Hey, welcome back to the Founders Journey Daily Spark, your daily dose for inspiration and insight for uh, startup founders like us. I'm your host, Greg Moran. Today, we're actually starting to dive in. We're going to spend a little time around this for the next few days around a crucial topic for startups, which is around hiring. Starting a business can be really fun, but building the right team <laughs> can have its challenges for sure, especially when you're working like a startup with really, really limited resources. So what I want to talk about today is some hiring strategies that can help you find talent without really breaking the bank. So first, if you're not doing it already, start tapping into your network. Think about mentors, colleagues, friends, People who may know someone with the skills you're looking for, personal referrals can be a real help when really trying to find motivated and reliable team members that can really share your vision, right? And that's the most important part here. Next, you want to really be creative in your job postings. Don't just list your qualifications, but tell your startup stories. If you haven't listened to our edition on the on telling your origin story, go back and listen to it. You want to attract can candidates who are genuinely passionate about your vision. Third, think about freelancers and contractors. The way that people work today has changed fundamentally. For a lot of startups, freelancers and contractors can really help you tap into a really strong, skilled uh, pool of talent that maybe can come at a little bit you know, easier cost or on a freelancer or fractional basis. And look at remote work and, you know, stop looking in just your geography if you're doing it. And I think this is changing really quickly, but, you know, really start to make sure that you've got the right tools and processes in place to manage a fully remote team and, and really go for it. And I know, you know, there's a lot of bias around, you know, for within a startup, making sure that people are uh, are nearby, but it doesn't always have to be that way. And look at conferences and industry events and things like that, that that right person for you may be at one of those events. So really start using those as networking as well. So there you have it, just a few strategies to use for uh, to use in your startup uh, for more effective, more effective hiring. Don't forget the the number one thing you can do to change the trajectory of your team or of your company is to build a better team. And each hire is going to really move you in that direction. So thanks for tuning in to today's Founders Journey Daily Spark. Make sure, please, if you could take a second, follow, subscribe, and like this video so that uh, more people can see it and you don't ever miss an episode. Thanks. See you next time.